Hi folks, in this video we are going to discuss a SQL question which was asked to me in PayPal's uh, data analyst interview. So uh, the question is that this is not a very uh, tough question but it's like a good question. So let's just start with the problem statement. We have a table here. The table has three columns. The name of the table is customer orders and it has three columns, customer ID, order value and customer segment. Now what we want as the output from this table is that we want for each segment, the I, I want the second highest value in that segment. So the, if there are, so this table has three segments basically, low risk, mid risk and high risk. So in each segment, I want the second highest value. Now this, uh, there can be uh, like many ways to solve this question. So first we will solve this using rank function. And uh, how are we going to do that? So this is, so this is the table. Uh, yeah, before going to the question, I would ask you to pause the video and uh, give it a try yourself. And uh, hoping that you have done that and let's just jump right into the solution. So this is the question and I'll create a CTE with CTE as where I will have the customer ID, the order value and for every, I will, I will use the rank function over I'll partition this by uh, in every segment I want uh, the ranking so I, I'll, I'm going to partition this by customer segment and I'm going to order this by order value in descending order okay so this is my CTE I will also select star from CTE just to look at the output so this is what it looks like now i want uh, like where rank is equal to 2 and i want output like this so i'll say select um order uh, i'll select the I want to select the customer segment and the order value. Here also I'll, in, in the CT I'll mention the customer segment. Now if I run this, this is what I want as the output. So this is one way of solving this question. There is another way of solving this question. So the question was solve this question using two ways. One way was using a window function but there is another way uh, using which we can solve this question which we will discuss in the next video so i hope you like this video i hope you found this video helpful if you did please do not forget to hit the like button and also to subscribe to this channel until next time thanks for watching